husband is behind bars, accused of murdering his own wife and then dumping her body in a ditch. An employee from a nearby camp discovered her body Sunday near the Sandy River in Clackamas County. And today, Martin Gallo Gallardo faced a judge. Amy Frazier was in that courtroom, and she also met with the victim's family. Amy? Jeff, the victim's family is absolutely devastated. They say she will be so missed, especially by her children. Inside a home in southeast Portland, grieving family members have lit candles for a mother who they say lived for her kids. Relatives asked not to be on camera, but they say they're doing everything they can to support 38-year-old Coral Rodriguez Lorenzo's three children. They've lost their mom, and their dad is now behind bars, accused in her murder. Sunday morning along Camp Numano Road in Clackamas County, a camp employee discovered the victim's body in a ditch. On Monday, detectives brought her husband in for questioning. They say 45-year-old Martin Gallo Gallardo confessed to his wife's murder. We've learned the husband and wife have been living with their children at an apartment off of 160th in Southeast Portland. According to court records, the husband was also arrested back in March, accused of assaulting his wife. A spokesperson with the Multnomah County District Attorney's Office says they wanted to prosecute the case and took it to a grand jury, but the grand jury decided the felony case couldn't proceed based on information at the time. Relatives tell us the mother had a big heart and loved dancing. Family members are now caring for the couple's children. Meanwhile, in court, the suspect entered a plea of not guilty. Relatives have set up a GoFundMe page to help with some of the funeral expenses. If you'd like to learn more about that, we have more information at coin.com. Reporting live in Clackamas County, Amy Frazier, Coin 6 News. The